Hi, my name is Natalie Doyle Oldfield. I'm the president of Success Through Trust and the author of the book, which is called The Power of Trust, How Top Companies Build, Manage, and Protect It. Today I'm going to give you a short overview of the online course, Becoming a Trusted Advisor. It's a self-paced online course for professionals who want to gain a competitive edge and they want to get deeper relationships of trust with their customers. Every customer, no matter who your customer is, wants to work with, deal with, buy from, support tr a trusted advisor. And everybody wants to have a trusted advisor, someone who's going to give them advice, someone who's going to have their best interests in mind. So this course is based on the science of how we decide to trust, and it's all outlined in my book. And um, there's an overview of the science of how we decide to trust in the workbook, which is included in this online self-directed course. Whether you're a site supervisor, a superintendent, a project manager, an engineer, or a field person on site that has to deal with customers, this course is for you to help you become a trusted advisor. In module one, we go over understanding what it means to be a trusted advisor. In this module, there's a video lesson, a self-reflection piece, and this is where you download the program workbook. Module two, we look at identifying what's important to clients. In module three, we look at the insights and in using the power of empathy. Module four covers listening proactively. This is an important skill for trusted advisors. Module five is setting and managing expectations. Module six, we're looking at packaging your trust messages. In module seven, we look at speaking the language of trust. And there's lots of phrases and checklists and words for you to look at in this module. Module eight is about being truthful and candid. Module nine is describing the issue on the client's terms. And we get into how to identify a customer's real issues and looking at thoughtful questions to ask. Module 10 is about understanding different client types. And module 11 is adding value and anticipating client needs. This module is really what separates someone to become a trusted advisor because trusted advisors know how to anticipate client needs and they know how to act in the client's best interests. And module 12 is building a long-term trusting relationship and we look at applying the principles of trust for the long term. Thank you so much for watching. We'd love to see you inside the accredited course Becoming a Trusted Advisor.